As reported, the situation in Gaza continues to worsen by the day. A correspondent, Nur Harassin, has the latest from the ground. Talking about the latest on the ground, and actually let me mention what is happening right now. I don't know if the voice is very clear, but several Israeli drones are hovering on the skies of uh, Deir al-Balah. I mean, we are seeing the drones with our own eyes. Uh, they are very close and they are going in circles around Middle uh, Gaza, even though Middle Gaza was marked as a safe area, specifically Deir al-Balah city, was marked as a safe area for Palestinian displaced people. However, since the early hours of this morning, we have been hearing Israeli shelling. Israeli drones did not even leave the skies of uh, Deir al-Balah and this actually gives a sense of fear to the Palestinian people on the uh, ground. Talking about the latest the Israeli uh, forces withdraw from large areas from northern Gaza. Palestinians in northern Gaza who are still in northern Gaza after of course the evacuation of more than one million people they managed to go out of their homes, film videos, take photos of Gaza's main uh, streets and post them on uh, social media and actually it was not that easy to get out of your home over the past few weeks due to the heavy uh, shelling and the Israeli land incursion in uh, northern Gaza. Here in uh, Meral Gaza, Palestinian Health uh, Ministry reported that 62 people were killed during the past 24 hours in uh, Khan Yunus and Rafah. Uh, the Palestinian Health Ministry reported that 80 people were killed during the past 24 hours. Nur Harazin, Telesur, Gaza.